catch more, man. Seen it all. Caught them all. Still Keep more. that rod bent! There's no limit to these big bass dreams. You know the name, fishing is my claim to fame uh -huh. I'm catching everything, and every fish is free, man I'm swim baits and jigs, rock shot rig When I get off the water, can't wait to hit Damn, I'm good <laughs> Good morning, guys Welcome back to the channel Oliver Nye here, appreciate you guys tuning in And welcome to another episode of Big Tuna Dreams If you look over my right shoulder there See a spot of tuna Working some bait. We just rolled into the zone. Say hello to Captain Riley. Hey everybody. She was the eagle eye that first spotted this little spot of fish and then almost simultaneously the rest of the crew saw him too. So we got my man Anthony Harris in the house today. Mr. Alex Pazarski who's been with me since the beginning. We got Zach handling the bean bag. Deck boss Mogo fishing. But uh, yeah, these don't look that big, so we're actually getting ready to throw some stick baits and top water at them with the spinning gear. Uh, it's early in the day, and hopefully it's a good one. It's going to be a hot one today. I think it was calling for 100 degrees at Catalina. So uh, we'll see what happens. you but we're coming up onto a foamer now we actually have a few foamers around us however this one looks like the meat so we're gonna deploy the kite with a balloon on it it's not too windy out today so that helium balloon really helps us get that kite up where we need it put on a flyer and then captain oliver is gonna maneuver the boat the correct way to put that flyer right in the middle of that foamer okay Alright guys, sliding up on this spot of fish here. We've got the dream team up front casting. Got the flyer about to drop in on their heads. Boat is in neutral. It is a great spot of fish. Chasing the little, those are big baits too, they're chasing. Hopefully, oh my god, it charged. Look at these freaking meat the missiles. Stick. Yeah, this, this little one's mixed in with the giant one. That's what's gonna be real. This is crazy about it. There's like 60 pounders mixed with 150s. I'm gonna leave on the pushers. Alright, guys, we got flyer out the back on the back side of this meatball. The poppers going up front. We got mixed size tuna up here, anywhere from 30 to 150 pounds. Everybody's working. Here we go. Oh, oh wow. you missed five. it. He's gonna come back. He's gonna come back. Oh, oh we're back. Oh, oh, he missed it, he he missed it. it again. Got Captain Riley running the show.
Oh, we're gonna get this so quick. You got the second one ready? Yeah. Oh, watch it. Oh my god. Oh my god, we're gonna the suspense. Oh, he bit! No, he missed it! He missed it! He bit! Oh. He got it! He got it! Got it. He got it. Got it. Got it. Not yet, not yet! Damn it! Freaking short bite, man. Oh, he's got it! 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 Oh, Yeah! Oh, he missed it! He didn't let it go! Jump it back! Jump it back! He spit it! He'll come back! There'll be another one. Damn, over oh, my dude, that was a monster blow up that time too. Uh, you got another one, Rig? Yeah. He's under it. He got his one under. You see him flash? Yep. Fish your bait a little bit, Josh. They're looking at it. There you go. Yeah, he pulled it all the way down that time too. Yeah, he, he had it down. There's some jumbos in there too. The little ones pretty much ignore the uh, the flyer. The big ones eat it. Come on. There we go. Oh, there's a big. If you got a spot of fish, you can cast that. Bring it in closer. Oh, he's on it. He's on. Yeah, there's one under it. Oh, he's on, oh, he's on it. Oh, did he get him? He's on, he's on, he's on, he's on. He wants it. I'll take it. <laughs> I ain't. This is gonna suck. I was like, you're Keep on. Keep whining. Damn, I'm good. <laughs> Where's another one? Where's another one? Uh, right here, bud. Take your time. It's not a giant. It's a good one, though. Keep, keep that rod bent. Yep. Alex. Hey, oh, fuck you, old guy. Oh, that's a good test for the brand new Quantum Benchmark. <laughs> Get a little bit more mad. How's it feel as a uh, born and raised Californian? Fishing uh this is pretty good. A spinner. This is a gar, right? <laughs> yeah, you've been in Texas too long. I know. I know. There you go. Get around those motors if you need to. Good job. There you go. Try not to do any pumping. Just okay. fight them with the reel. Okay. Right? You want to hold the rod in steady position. Yep. And just to refrain from yanking and making that hole oh, yeah, smell they'll, bigger. They'll rip on the troubles, yeah, right? Totally. Like, you need to reel and just drop it right on their head. You didn't even have to move it. I might have done this a time or two. Not bad for a crappie fisherman. Yeah. There you go. Nice, nice and easy. A bluegill guy. Nice and easy, right there. Keep faster, a little faster, a little faster. He's gonna, gonna come left. Yep, just watch those motors. Here you go. Ah, uh, Alex. Welcome home, brother. Hooked up to a bluefin in how long? It's been a while. Oh, dude, it's been since we hooked that one off, off on you for... Was it off Newport? Uh, keep on it. In the 2019? Yep. January 3rd, three miles uh, outside the harbor. Well, it's 2024. Alex has hooked up to a pretty good one on the spinner. Let's see if it's a winner. Good test for the new benchmark. Look, if you need to, you can use this, but you'd be a big punani. Oh, I gotta watch what I say. It's 2024, like I said, not 1994. Right, follow him up. You need to keep that. You need to keep that rod perpendicular. Yep. Here he's coming around. There you go. It's like you fished a sport oh. before. Rod broke. <laughs> oh well. No, that's gonna be fun. That's warranty. Yeah. Yeah. Here you go. Whoa, whoa, watch that thing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dude, I didn't even touch the rail either. Okay. All right. Ah, just bump the drag up now. I don't matter now. No, fishing was too easy. Just point it at it and reel. 
Oh, let me see your drag. Point it out the trail. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my gosh. It's like a little ice rod. That feels like kind of like a trout pole. It's a real thing. Keep that line off the reel. Put some tape on the uh, on the end. No, nah, it's a tiny spot. I mean, you can if you'd like to. Where's that? Where's that gorilla tape? It wasn't bad. Or, you know what? Just keep that thing away from the boat. Obviously, you got to focus a little bit more now. If we land this fish, it's gonna be epic. <laughs> There you go. Job is our ski. Let's get like a watch right here coming down. Nice. <laughs> Keep that rod bent! I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> now he's got all the power. Now he's got all the power to kill this thing. Easy, easy, yep. Look at that rod bent. There you go. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> you laughed, I didn't laugh. Child was fine. Off the rod, or off the boat, off the boat. There you go. Rod. <laughs> yeah, two guides is better than one. How's it drag? Is it okay? Yeah, it's fine. Back kill it like this. If you need to rotate off, you got fresh bodies. Yeah, I might be a bitch on this one. All right, who wants to play for a little while? Yeah, you know, or Zach? Who? Zach? Zach, are you fully mobile yet yeah, or not really? No leverage. No leverage? Just gonna try to fucking. Alex has almost gotten in, uh, pulled in a couple times now. Oh, how's that feel? <laughs> There's like no leverage. Like, you just gotta kind of work them up. We're gaining. There you go. There you go. Yeah, hold his uh, bibs if you need to. I got you. It's always something. <laughs> you know, you buy yeah, the be best easy. gear. It's like a frog rod. Try to control all the variables within our control. I make the right cast. So we get this fish, teed it, come tight. Alex did just about everything right. So then we the truck. Freak accident. <laughs> Broke that rod. How deep are we? It's like you have no weather to watch. <laughs> no, dude, this is just, just a grown up Snoopy pole. Yeah, that's what it feels like. The man's <laughs> game. A man's game? Did you really just say I mean, this is a woman's game. While I'm on the boat? It's a woman's game. Wow, you guys. It's all gender game. <laughs> Sexist. Dude, 2024 is brutal. 2024 and there's still sex. I'm gonna kill this thing. Yeah, you can... I got, uh, uh, 400 feet. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> back up. Oh, you need a packy out on me? <laughs> easy, easy, easy. To seize on me. You gotta focus here. You gotta keep those jerky movements to a minimum. <laughs> I know, I know. Rod, bro. <laughs> so like, hey, what you need to do is pull the line. Hey, do you want to start? Yeah, there you go. And like, uh, talk to each other. Here, so, so, hold on, right, let me stop. Anthony, as you pull, you tell him when to yeah. wind. Up, 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 up. Wind, 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 wind. And again. Wind, 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 wind. Can you pinch Step that spool? What's that? Oh, a pinch? Here we go. So he doesn't take me because he's fucking ready to die. Yeah. He's not tiny. Hey, don't let us head up. Get the other one, Josh. It's not tiny. I'm gonna bump drag up. Did you kill him? Yeah, fine. Keep it. If you keep its head from going down, yeah. you can't dig. It'll come right to you. Check the seat. There you go. Reach out, reach out, reach out. Find it. Alright, he's gonna have two more circles. Two yeah. more big circles. Good job. Oh, shit. 
60. Zach, you don't want that smoke or what? <laughs> <laughs> Is Zach still in the boat? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Zach's like as far away from that as he can be. He's like, uh uh. So the whole point of that Yuka Jimin is so one, you put him out of his misery, he, she, it, and two, that way they uh, actually taste better when you Yuka him and then bleed them out right away, put them on ice, and that meat tastes so much better. So try it if you haven't already. Also, you should always just put them out of their misery anyway. Be humane about it, people. <laughs> I don't know if they made travel tuner rods. If you guys didn't see what he caught it on, that's our uh, cast um, collab with Big Bass Screens smelt color. The OG, I believe that's the 40 gram, but it will show you when it gets a little closer up. There it is, little 20 gram. 20 gram. Down under. That anchovies, what they're eating, little baits. Did it again. <laughs> That's all. It's not the OG. Yeah, yeah. This is the Kobe. Actually, the down under 20 grams. Big tuna dreams. Big tuna dreams collab with cast. Smell color. This thing is fucking awesome. Come on. I don't know, huh? <laughs> Midday update. We've had 0 for 5 on the flyer. Uh, one on the popper that is in the bag. We've been running over 100 miles so far and we're on what looks like building a building foamer. Uh, so we're going to put out the kite, deploying it now. You guys can see that huge flock of birds. There's some foam underneath it. But as you can see, there's so many moving parts with all these wires. We have different rods, a few lines out. We're also trying to throw some poppers on the smaller fish. These bigger fish, we can't really throw these. Um, Spinning gear. Yeah. Now they're going. <laughs> these fish do seem to be a little boat shy, so we're purposely staying off of them as far as we can. Oh, those are big ones too. I don't know if I want this one, but let's go. Cool. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, there's some big ones. I don't know if I want to come back, but... <sighs> Man, what a day. It is closing in on 5 o'clock here. We've had a full day out on these outer grounds. Long run, covered a lot of water. We had our shots. How many bites today did we have today, Mr. Yosh? Six bites. Six whole bites. The one stuck on something else. I'll go get to you on that one. <laughs> so yeah, we, we stuck one on the top water uh, as some of these smaller fish charge the boat. 
and we went one for one on the casting bait on the stick bait slash diving popper so thankful for that we had five epic bites on the flyer i mean epic bites they just didn't stick just how it goes and we fished several spots of fish today uh, and they were just being fickle there were a couple times where we, de we deployed the baits and fished it perfectly through the zone big blue fan busting bait all over the place uh, five takedowns did not connect with any of them you got anything for the people at home anthony Got some water <laughs> at least we got something to show for it we did we got one it's always a good day when you can come home without a skunk so. that's right one for six is better than oh for <laughs> the oprah days are rough how you living back there pretty comfortable actually <laughs> Not too shabby at all. Beautiful day. Beautiful day. Come out here, get some sun, some splash. Still worth it. Yeah, you glad you called in from work? Oh yeah. That's what's up. Oh yeah. Awesome. You guys should check out Zach's Instagram, which is Dreadnought Irons. Oh. Dreadnought underscore irons. Got it. Or some uh, CNC surface iron and yo-yo action. Nice. Yes. Anthony's actually seen those put to use on his boat. Oh, it was fun. It's uh, tough on the thing tackle. It was, it was a popper fish on that light tackle, but it was fun. We got, we got our butts kicked. We broke one and a half there a little bit. But <laughs> two guys is not enough for salt water. That custom four foot two jig stick <laughs> made it pretty interesting. So good times. Glad we made it out from Texas. Got to see some old friends. So all in all, great trip. Great bachelor party. Yeah, It'll be a little late for the bachelor party, but it's all good. <laughs> good day today out in the water. Beautiful, it's hot. And if you guys are coming out tomorrow. It's um, wear your uh, tank top. <laughs> tank top <laughs> shorts. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a good day. Great day. Again, we got one, six bites. One on the uh, stick bake made by that cast. Well, we found the fish. Found a zone with some activity so we're gonna run it back tomorrow we got another training session out here uh, hopefully they bite and hopefully they commit and hopefully we connect captain what do you got for us 120 miles for that, one fish it's a long I'm way tuna fishing for you. so i'm just glad that um alex was able to get on one because we took him away from a party and his dad uh, Sorry, Dave. So if he's watching that, he can blame us. But it was all in all, it was really worth it. Today was the first day the weather was this nice. So I'd rather be out here than in an office. That's right. Cheers. Shout out to our friends at Tigris. Kite flew perfectly all day. Able to let us fly that bait right into the strike zone. Ah. And that's a wrap.